The remains of eight British uh, Hurricane fighter planes have been found buried in a forest in Ukraine. Uh, they're from uh, the time of World War II. The uh, aircraft were sent to the Soviet Union by Britain after Nazi Germany invaded uh, in 1941. Here's our diplomatic correspondent, James Landau. In a forest south of Kyiv, down in an old riverbed, something unexpected. The remains of old aircraft hidden deep in the ground, and each one British to their rusty core. Here you see the tailplane of uh, Hurricane Mark II. Yes, you heard that right. This was once part of a Hurricane fighter plane, one of thousands Britain gave the Soviet Union during World War II. This is a little slice of history, evidence of a moment when, 80 years ago, Western powers gave warplanes to Ukraine, just as they are today, to defend against an invading army. So you think there might be a seventh yep. hurricane down yeah. here? Seven, and uh, here is, uh, under this frame, there is eight. Many of the hurricanes were destroyed, fighting the invading German army. Others were stripped for parts, but some, like these, were deliberately hidden down here. Week after week, the fuel took their planes into the air. The hurricane may have been the workhorse of the Battle of Britain, shooting down more enemy aircraft than the Spitfire, but... Mark the collaboration between British and Russian flyers. Many also saw action in the frozen wastes of the USSR. Every plane made in Britain, every plane paid for by the United States. And that's why these heavy frames were dumped here after the war, so the Soviets didn't have to pay the US back for any hurricanes left intact, as had been agreed. Those who discovered the plane say they made a real difference. Hurricane was a strong, easy to fly machine, stable as a gun platform, uh, suitable for not experienced pilots and uh, reliable aircraft. These may look like unremarkable bits of metal, but to Ukraine's aviation museum, they're symbols of British assistance that echo down the years. The Britain was the first who supplied fighting aircraft for the Soviet Union. Now, the Great Britain is the first, uh, first country which uh, gives Storm Shadow cruise missiles to our uh, armed forces. Is history repeating itself? Yes, of course. The museum hopes to find enough parts to reconstruct one entire hurricane, to look, if not to fly, like this, as once they did in the skies over Ukraine. James Landell, BBC News, Kyiv.